Now, if you look, for instance, at people that are filled with ma'asiya and dissipate themselves, they expend all of their energies in ma'asiya, you will notice that by the age of 25 or 30, there is a darkness that has descended upon their faces. Ahlul ma'asiya. See, young people, whether they're Muslim or non-Muslim or whatever, young people have a light. And that light is simply the fact that they have not accrued a lot of wrong actions. That's why if you see dark young people, you know something seriously wrong. But there is a light in youth that is simply the vigor of youth. And it's also the fact that young people have not accrued a lot of wrongs. If you look at children, it's stunning. Why are people so attracted to the faces of little children? Because they see innocence. Why is that innocence there? Because there's no wrong actions. So you're attracted to purity by nature. And that attraction in really sick people is what causes these problems in this culture. And it's a problem in the Muslim world as well. Because that attraction becomes sick. Because there's platonic attraction. There's people that are attracted to virtuous people. That's their nature. There's people that are attracted to those people. But shaitan, nafs, hawa, dunya, they like their portion in attraction. And so they will attempt to take something that's pure and defile it. That's the nature of the dunya, is defilement. It's what the people of Ihsan call kudurat. It's the kudurat of dunya. You kaddiru. Kaddara in Arabic means to stir up the mud at the bottom of a pond. You have a clear pond, limpid, easy to look down and see the bottom. But if you muck up the bottom, then you stir up all of that dirt. Well, that's the nature of the soul, that if you allow these ma'asiyah to be stirred up, they will eventually muddy the purity of the self. Because we are made of mud, and it's our nature, but we're also made of spirit. So whichever one's dominating is the one that's going to show itself. Well, so if you look out there, I mean, I wanted to do just an experiment where you took all of the pictures of our awliya, our people, righteous people, and then just put pictures of all the old people in the dunya and just show the faces, just show the faces and let people see for themselves which group they want to be among when they get old. And this is not about knowledge even, because you can see faces of purity in villages amongst the simplest people. 